Hey guys, it's Diana. Um, I'm going to be doing my video on the college culture. Um, I, watching the lectures, I thought it was really interesting that there were such different um, attitudes during different times, like during um, right after World War II, how the students were just so relieved to be alive that, you know, college was really just a relaxing, happy time, you know, and then in the 70s it was uh, anger with um, the the government started seeing being corrupt and there were the murders of JFK and uh, Martin Luther King and then I was thinking about today's culture and um, trying to think like I'm I was, I was already, I think I was about 20 on 9-11, I was already, I was at work when, um, when 9-11 happened, and, um, you know, I know that it affected me a certain way as somewhat of an adult, a young adult, um, but I hadn't really thought of how it might have, and probably did affect the younger generation, um, those that form their their opinions on the world based on what's going on in society and I wonder what effect that has had on the Millennials um, I don't know I mean around campus there are the uh, I wouldn't say it's not like during the 70s with protests and stuff but there are protests um, I don't know, I see sometimes they have, I don't know what they're doing, but I see some people have a booth set up sometimes like in the quad or in front of the U building or something um, with Obama <coughs> with uh, a mustache like Hitler saying that Obama is Hitler. I don't know, I don't know what that has to do with, I kind of run the other way when I see it, but <laughs> um, so yeah, I find it interesting and sad that um, that the younger generation is growing up with those fears of terror, you know, terrorism, um, and I, I wonder how that's going to affect people. Um, uh, yeah, bioterror is is a millennial millennial issue, I think. Um, so I wonder. I'm I'm trying to think of how the people in further generations down the road will look back at us or if if the millennials will look at the next generation like you don't appreciate what we did for you or you know because it just seems to be the same thing repeated in a sense where the previous generation is always th saying you know they don't seem to understand each other maybe um although I think generation x and the millennials are closer I guess but anyways, um, I think I've spent enough time talking, so that's what I have to say about that. And thank you all for watching my video.